Well, let us begin. Are you ready? Yeah, that's... That's how she reads your fortune. <laughs> pumpkin... Yeah, pumpkin panty fortune telling. Here we go. That's kind of creepy. I found that really disturbing, especially, you know, when I was a kid <laughs> playing this game. I'm like, what? In my mind, I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> Oh, that's a fruit merchant, looking strangely at some kind of a ball. Hmm, carrying it away somewhere. Oops, that's it. <laughs> well, that was lame. But yeah, we, I think if we just go back to talking to her, I think there's a little bit of something there. There, that's it. Should we talk to the genie, or talk about the genie too? I saw that in there. Where's the dark genie now? Well, let us begin. Are you ready? Yeah, I don't care about that sentence. <laughs> ah, there it is. It, this is some castle. Looks like some kind of a giant haunted house. This is who they call the Dark Genie? He's pretty arrogant. Oh, who's this? Looks like he's saying something. Oh, what a huge yawn. Oh, he got up? Or, oh, he got up. <laughs> Scratch his ass. The guy is talking, planning to destroy another town? Evil smile. Huh? That's all? That's kind of creepy. The way that the dark genie just approaches the camera like that. Huh. Or there, that's it. I don't know why I said huh. Whatever. It's kind of pointless information, really. Okay, let's see. Let's talk to the old lady again. Yep, another cutscene. What? A moon orb? What's that? I've never heard of it. Aha, uh -huh, that's... That pretty sphere mixed up in all that fruit. Let's see now. I, w I wonder what I did with it. I think I gave it away to someone who asked for it at the market. I don't remember who I gave it to, sorry. I've been forgetful lately. Yeah, tell me about it. Sorry about that. Yeah, so it's kind of pointless. <laughs> oh, that's right, we got put Basker in his place. Or finish the cathedral. Let's just finish the cathedral. There we go. I was forgetting what I was needing to put it up there. <laughs> Let's grab this. Bag is full, fuck. What do I have that I need to get rid of? I can tell you I'm this much, I don't need that. Another gourd. Speaking of, I probably should use all that shit. I got like, yeah, a whole bunch. Oh, I guess 170 is the max health. Well, might as well add it to her. How about Gord-wise? He's peaked. Okay, I don't know, we'll just add it to her. And her. We'll just give one more to her and then give one to... Uh, what's his name? Goro. Okay.
Oh, you are at home. Hi, Phil. <laughs> I've been waiting for you. Thanks to you, this legendary cathedral is back to the way it was. Back to its days of old. Thank you very much. This is a little something to show my appreciation. If I can be of any help, don't hesitate to ask. Yeah, I kind of expected that. By the way, Tone. Oh, jeez. I think he's... Yep. Have you heard of the story of the curse of the cathedral? For a hundred years, we didn't have any weddings in this cathedral. In Queens, nobody wants to have a wedding here. It is because any couples who had their weddings here always end up separating. It is the curse cast over the cathedral. This is a story my grandfather told me. A hundred years ago, this town was a kingdom ruled by a queen called Lasaya. Lasaya was only 18 when she ascended to the throne. The people all trusted her and revered her as a great ruler. This is to say nothing of her beauty, which words could not describe. The radiance of her smile made all around her happy. Then one day she fell in love with a young man in town. The queen and the commoner. It was only after the town was asleep in the night they would they could meet. The two hid their love from the world for a long time. Finally they decided to have a wedding ceremony. Yes, in this very church, deep in the night where all were asleep. But on that night, the groom did not appear, as was promised. Dressed in white, she continued to wait, believing he'd come. Night after night, she continued to wait, but her love never came. The loss of her love was too much to bear, and one night she threw herself in the ocean. That's when the curse began. Since then, all couples that married in this church eventually ended up leaving each, each other. What do you think? Isn't it sad? Now nobody even visits this cathedral. But I still keep protecting the cathedral. He really likes saying cathedral. <laughs> Someday this curse will be lifted, and many loving couples will swear their eternal love lover here until that day. Now, Mr. Tone, please excuse me today. Yeah, whatever, Phil. If you are interested in Queens, why don't you visit the Dividing House? I already have, thanks. Unless if that unlocks another thing. Hey, a pocket! It's about damn time I found a pocket. Really needed that. Woo! Now I got more shit I can carry. Anything over there? Oh, damn it. Holy. What a surprise. And the holy gem. Even more of a surprise. Shocker. Alright, let's see if that did anything or not. Can you tell me my fortune? Where is the man who the queen loved? Well, let us begin. Are you ready? Yeah, yeah. Unfortunately. Pumpkin, pumpkin, panty, shit, whatever. Hmm, I've seen this before. Ah, oh, that's right. It's Rando's, or, yeah, Rando's store. It was a Rando who eloped, eloped with the Queen, was it? No, that's impossible. That was a hundred years ago. He couldn't be that old. Something's glowing. What is it? Spoiler!
it is him. Alright. I think we're done talking to her now. For the last time. I hope so. Okay, let's help out Basker now. Yeah, put that there. That there. And see if we can help him out. A gourd. Always need gourds. You are not from here, but it's okay. I don't like snooping around, though. I'm Basker. I'm a trader. Good to meet you. Oh, well, you're already here. Try to enjoy Queens as much as possible. Anything I can do? Store had a second floor, so I really need the back. All right. So let's add the second floor. Just gonna look around a little bit before I enter inside. God dang it. God dang the transitions. Oh, you're actually able to enter into that. What's even in here? Anything? That's kind of pointless. It's kind of a strange little room. I don't know why they would make that in this game. Hey, a Mimic Breaker. Sweet. Oh my god, there we go. Hey, Tone. Thanks to you, my store's back. Right now, I don't have anything in the store to sell. I mostly do trading. I sell goods I purchased from other countries to merchants here in Queens. I'm really sorry I can't be any help of you. By the way, Tone, I hear you've been traveling a lot. Do you have any plants from which I can make herbal medicine? In the islands off the west, health-related goods are very popular. Various herbs are really popular now. Anything that can be a base for herbal medicine sells really well. If you have anything of that sort, I'll gladly trade you something for it. I don't, but... But you have it right there. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I can't really put anything away either. God dang it. Okay. Let's give it to ya. Got a little bit of time. Oh boy, is this an ointment leaf? Tone, this is amazing. It's the first time I've ever seen the real thing. With this leaf, you can make a cure-all medicine. Good for any illness. Do you want to trade this with me? Thanks. I'll give you something great in return. Just a minute. Please take this. Foundation acquired. This is a new product just released in Rondo City. A magical powder that makes women beautiful when they put it on. So, makeup? Give it to your girlfriend, she'll love it. <laughs> okay, and now I'm just going to give it back to you. If I can find it, there it is. Alright, see ya, whatever. Okay, I'm going to do a quick save too. And just give me a second here.